One personnel at one of the branches of the restaurant chain says supplies of ground provisions have become inconsistent due to the dry spell. President of the Jamaica Agricultural Society, Lenworth Fulton, says several vegetables have been extremely scarce and may not be in production again until the next rainy season. Most of the vegetables, onions, Irish potato, cabbage, lettuce, cucumber, they have all been hit by the severe drought. And so therefore, we won't be able to produce some of those, I think, until about October when we expect that the rainy season has come back on us. Last week, Agriculture Minister Audley Shaw said despite crop production being severely affected by the sharp decline in rainfall, there is no need for increased imports of produce. However, Mr. Fulton says as it is now, importation may become the only choice. We haven't got adequate irrigation system to supply water to these farms to produce these crops. So we are in really a dilemma, and it's quite likely that the government might have to regrettably um, import some of these produce. The agricultural president laments that the money allocated for drought alleviation in the agricultural sector is not enough. It is not enough, but how the government releases money is as it comes. I'm quite certain that there will be other allocations. But it's a start, you know, remember that when the government make a budget, it's zero budgeting. So they will have to cut from somewhere to find the money. And so I do understand. I'm not calling with them. But those are not sufficient to alleviate the problem that we are facing. Cody and Barrett, Frontline News.